Number 1. Ultra Weighty Liftland and or Water Capable Connector We've seen a few pretty weighty vehicles figure out how to advance into the water from vehicles to RVs you can't get any heavier than that right well think again Ultra Weighty Liftland and or Water Capable Connector is a magnificent water vehicle. What's more, presumably the best land and or water capable military vehicle available it utilizes an extraordinary innovation in the stepping framework that makes it unquestionably lightweight and uses air-filled froth tires that apply just a single pound of pressure per square inch so for something so enormous the ultra-weighty lift land and or water-capable connector is still inconceivably light and it can deal with in a real sense any territory on the planet and stands over the rest at 18 feet tall however when it gets to the oceans this vehicle ain't withdrawing indeed even with the heaviest conceivable burden on board it can go on the water utilizing its stepping as oars and can come to a maximum velocity of 20 bunches and Number 2 Hyundai Zombie Endurance Vehicle The name ought to say everything Hyundai Zombie Endurance Vehicle appearing at Comic Con out of every other place on Earth this vehicle is going to allow you to experience your best distraught max life. The detriment of mind spreads I mean gander at this thing it's equipped with a spike. Ferro spikes on the wheels also. Floodlights on top so you know precisely who and what you're cutting down at the entire hours of the night the window and windshield are completely defensively covered so if you truly do hit a major one you will not need to stress over them. Blasting through the glass there's additional Y-back floodlights to blind anybody following you in a rapid pursuit to the furthest limit of the world, and the trunk returns to the edge with a various arrangement of weapon ring not to notice the CB radio to talk it up with your companions in the interceptor nobody's going to screw with you assuming that you're driving this thing since it's really self-evident that you understand what you're doing. Number 3. The TMC Dumont There's this saying there's no place to go except for up it can genuinely apply to anyone however things truly go to a higher level when it applies to a resigned equation one driver Brazil's Tarso Marquez has many two-wheeled activities sitting in his carport yet his TMC Dumont Cruiser is one of the most uncommon if not the most incredible unquestionably a head-turner when it's out and about his TMC Dumont Cruiser appears as though it came straight from a Bond film it kisses the center points farewell and trades out the conventional motor for a 1960s Rolls-Royce airplane motor to assist with emitting that smooth cutting-edge energy the airplane motor is arranged right where the standard cruiser motor and gas tank would go just it takes up altogether more space and nearly fills in as the TMC Dumont's full casing. And about those wheels the bike has 36 inches spokeless wheels for a totally open focus configuration so coupled that with a 300 pull motor it's really disturbing you can't understand which brakes the vehicle is working with and keeping in mind that this is in fact still in an idea stage it is a lot of genuine and Tarso Marcus can indeed even be seen cruising on it and since it's so low to the ground he wants to keep away from hindrances and potholes by any stretch of the imagination cost. Number 4. LMB 496 La Moto Volante worked to resist the chances of physical science and gravity The LMB 496 La Moto Volante is a fly-fueled machine with a shifting four-wheeler worked around a crazy fire breathing 470 torque Maserati motor and keeping in mind that that data might be a ton for non-gearheads to take on the whole you truly need to know is that it's a flying bike The Volante has traded out its internal combustion factory for an electric drivetrain to give it a pleasant 62-mile range when it's in a not unexpected bike mode which is with the flip of a switch the wheels using pressurized water move from their upstanding direction to a flat one and give the experience that we see here from that point those four fly turbines jump out from the four wheel center points and in 60 seconds or less you can express farewell to the ground controlled by 496,000 rpm stream feline turbines this cruiser is shockingly light at 308 pounds however conveys around 530 pounds pushed for around 130 strength and notwithstanding being so tactless during departure off the Volante disguises a lamp fuel tank inside the composite body with sufficient fuel ability to consider a brief flight in any case. When she begins flying the rider approaches the entirety of the fundamental flight data like speed position also elevation right on the scramble joysticks on one or the other side of the handlebars permit for flight control alongside a speedy hit of adrenaline and keeping in mind that this may not be the most secure vehicle in the carport those four fly fila turbines were made by similar individuals who chipped away at NASA's X-56A test airplane so it's still lovely genuine. Number 5. Commas Flex Futurum At times the best plans have previously been made by Earth's life-giving force so same difference either way utilize them on a transport 
or a truck the commas flex futurum is a great plan idea for Melina Petrova and Konstantin Fedorov that has the potential to be the eventual fate of cargo transportation the commas flex futurum is made of a tremendous caterpillar train that seems as though it fits in better in a sci-fi film however the creators are expecting to have it out and about by 2040.